Hi, um, so I wanted to say thank you for considering me. Um, and I'm gonna talk about the idea of countertransference today. Um, so what that means is when a client tells something that is um, something usually upsetting, but it doesn't have to be, um, to a therapist about the client's life or about a situation or a person, it could be about basically anything. Um, and then the therapist hears that information and then the therapist internalizes it as it's about them um, or can be internalized in um, a way that they are um, taking it personal. So um, after that, the client, or I'm sorry, the therapist then um, reacts based on that um, information back to the client and um, it actually creates um, a very, it, it doesn't really help the therapeutic relationship because um, the therapist is making the information about them usually, um, or can again be um, a reaction that they got from the client based on what the client said. Um, so that's one, um, that's countertransference. Um, Usually, the um, therapist would have to um, talk to a supervisor about that so that the um, client doesn't have any um, negative repercussions out of that situation so that um, the therapist can realize that they should not be um, reacting to what the client says and taking it personal. So um, I hope that makes sense. Um, and then... Please let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.